What's up, guys? Brandon Kessler here, Cabo Cribs, Instagram BK Cabo, YouTube BK Cabo. Little, little flies here. Uh, say hello to Lola. Hola, hola, como estas? I'm the cutest dog in all of Cabo. Hola, hola, hola. <laughs> okay, so this video, we're going to be, um, I'm going to show you guys every everything in the market starting at one hundred thousand dollars and then moving all the way down all, all the way up rather to one million dollars so meaning we're going to start at a hundred thousand then we're going to go to two hundred thousand three hundred thousand four hundred five hundred and so forth now of course my numbers these aren't going to be exact but i found you the best properties that were around that price range all right so let's start with number one as you can see here this is morgan residencias and this is a loft at 109,000 and around this price range right now the, the market in Cabo there's not a lot at all I mean even in the $200,000 range there's not a lot you've got to get up to at least three to really have uh, some options but this is a nice place it's quite small it is a remodel so let's look through here a little bit and the cool thing is here look you can see where it's located here on the map and it's maybe a five minute drive into town. You're right at the marina. It's a straight shot right into town. I have a, another friend that actually just bought a place over there. What actually I like about this, okay, this unit, again, for this price range, it's gonna be ground floor with a little loft up top. It's very beautifully remodeled. And what I like is the top, yeah. It's got a beautiful pool with a bar. I mean, you can just imagine, you know, chilling up there with some margaritas, having a nice time. I'm sure they're going to have some nice parties up there. And um, for that price point at a hundred grand, I mean, that's pretty nice. And it has a gym. So there we go. Let's go. All right, let's move along here. Number two, this is Vista Marie. This is phase three. So these guys are doing an excellent job. This is my neighbor actually, who's building this project. And he is doing, he's hitting all of his dates actually above schedule. And this is a, probably about a year out, but everything that he's doing with this project is high quality. You can look inside here, maybe I'll open this up so we can see a little better, but it is all very high quality and and really turning out beautiful because I seen this when it was just dirt. He's moving fast. I mean, this is the tower one that is uh, completely finished already. It's got the pool, has an amazing gym and they are doing financing as well. So this is what well, you can see is already built and they've got tower two that's I believe already sold out. And now they're starting on to tower two, or excuse me, tower three. So the cool thing is, yeah, they can do financing like 35% down. And then the price gets lower, of course, the higher you put down. So if you were to put 50% down or 60% down, then you're actually going to even drop the price lower. They have a, a number of units here. Um, this, again, also is going to be ground floor for that price point. But very nice. And again, I know the developer. So that's why I know that this project is going to be done and it's going to be done right. All right, moving along here. Let's look on the map here. This is right downtown again. Casa Playa, Playa Marina Sol, and very close to downtown. We got a couple of flies in, and Lola keeps trying to, to bite these bite these flies. Get them, get them. Okay, let's scroll through this here. What's the square footage on this? Again, 847 square feet, one bedroom. So when you're downtown at this price, I mean, you're not typically going to, you're not typically going to get a very big place at this price range this is actually one of very few spots that i could find available and uh, i mean you're going to be right downtown 300k again it's a it is a smaller unit but you're downtown this one also downtown the parisio residencias and this is right located at the mall like you're right on the marina as close as you can get to downtown so if you want to uh not ever have to worry about taxis or ubers I mean, this is this is it for you. Again, one bedroom, uh, thirteen hundred square feet, and most of these are done very similar. But again, also high quality. 
They always have a loft that goes upstairs. A lot of them have jacuzzis. Uh, I've stayed in this before as an Airbnb. Very modern style and very cool. Moving along now to the $500,000 range. Oh, right here in, in my hood, my neck of the woods. So this is Copala, which is one of my favorite places. And that is because you get access to six resorts. And actually, they're even building more out here as well, St. Regis. And this is a ground floor unit for $525, but that's actually not the real price. I know that I can get this down to around $450, at least $475, maybe lower, um, because it is ground floor. And um, yeah, but still, I mean, 2,000 square feet, and it's the amenities that you get in this. That's what's that's what's so cool about living here. I mean, you get access to Polo Benito uh, Sunset, Monte Cristo, Polo Benito uh, Pacifica. And then you also get the uh, the sister resorts on the other side, which is uh, Polo Benito, um, Rosé and Blanco. It's got a little pool, jacuzzi. I mean, excuse me, I've got a little pool here with the barbecue, the outdoor kitchen. It's got a palapa. I mean, and it's completely finished as well. So turnkey, come on in. Very cool. Um, yeah, and it's ten minutes, a ten minute drive into town as well. Probably one of my one of my uh, favorite locations. Okay, we're at another unit here. Let me look on the map and see where this is. So this is up past past Tazal, kind of right right in that same area for five forty nine. Uh, it's a two bed, uh, almost 27, oh, 26,000 square feet. And let's open these pictures up and look. A very nice view. You're going to be on the arc side. Arcs, arch. It's kind of like your Mexican style. And it looks, it looks nice. I mean, so work that view, big open views. Parking. Looks like it needs updated furniture a little bit, but but still not, not bad. Let's move along here. Uh, we are in the, did I miss 600? I might have done worse things. Okay, we're at $769,000. This is big, four bedrooms. 404,233 4, square feet. And this is also in the same area. Looks like it's up a little higher. So that's going to give you an excellent view. Let's open this up. I mean, you've got your own private pool, private jacuzzi. Looks, I mean, that's a, that's a pretty sweet house. You've got nobody in front of you. Have to make sure and see if they have plans to come on bro i'm trying to make a video dude it's not even cool okay come on dude seriously i don't know why these i had to turn off the fan because i didn't want fan uh actually i like the way that this is uh remodeled it's like it's like uh, your typical mexican style but also very a little bit of modern style mixed in with it and i mean look at that view let's go back to that one there very cool i love the open floor floor plan and I love when they're very uh, wide I love when they, they open wide like four or four doors like even mine is only three doors so it just really gives it a cool open feeling to it very cool and I'll, I'll mark I'll put the I'll put a link to all these below this video so if you guys want to check them out so right here 849 so this is uh also, Copala, the one I was talking about before, one of my favorite project or favorite communities. Again, just because you get access, even in Copala here, you've got, I think we've got seven pools in here, community uh, jacuzzi. You get, um, I mean, look at the view from here as well. Really nice. And that view is spectacular. You get the this is the community jacuzzi with the pool aerial shot i mean the view from here from this villa is amazing so this is actually the sky bar or the sky pool at pueblo benito uh 
called Sunset, and you get access to this. It's cool. They have free shuttle rides. You can get up there. You can use all the other resorts like Pacific, uh, Monte Cristo. You've probably heard me mention that in my other videos because I very much like this community. Um, and this is very well decorated. They actually painted all the walls white, which is much better than most of the units have the kind of ugly yellow. And it makes a huge difference with the white. It gives it that modern feel. This has the gym, but doesn't actually show the upgrades because the this gym has, uh, now it has a Smith machine. It has cables. They did, a, they did a really nice job upgrading that. So moving along. And if you want to view any of these guys, go ahead, send me a message. And um, I, can, I can show you these. Let's move this guy down to the bottom here so we can see. This is in, looks like Cabo Bayo. And this is uh, Villa Parecio for 939,000, almost 5,000 square feet, three bedrooms, private pool. I mean, that looks very cool. Cabo Bayo is a, a very nice area. You you have access to the beach. Um, it's a gated community as well. Scroll through here and look at some of those pictures. Again, this is more of your typical Mexican slash modern style kind of combined. And the area is very nice. I mean, most people like Cabo Bello as you get a nice view to the ocean. It's like it's got an outdoor, outdoor um, fire pit and Outdoor kitchen. Almost looks like one of my friend's house here. It's not it though. Yeah. And at that price, not bad at all. 940000 So let's move along to number 10, a million bucks. So honestly, I couldn't find a lot at a million bucks. It's kind of a strange price point and there wasn't a lot out there. So we're back to the Paracio residence, yes. And this is right again at the mall, as you can see on the map here. And you're going to be right downtown. But this is a, a souped up unit, a unit with a view, rather. I mean, you're going to be looking right over the marina. This is location, location, location. There's two flies that are really messing with me here. I mean, what a spectacular view. So the unit that I actually stayed in didn't have this. It was kind of tucked away in the back. There wasn't that much of a view. And that's the, the difference on the price points on these as well. And I have one more, one more special unit that actually is pending. But uh, I'm, I figured I'd throw it on here just in case. And this is at 1.299, four, almost 4,000 square feet, three bedrooms, one of the nicest properties. Look at that handsome young man right there. Let's scroll through these here. This is in Rancho San Lucas. This is your view of the Greg Norman Signature Golf Course. This is comes with a two-car garage. Comes with a Harley. Are you kidding me? I mean, this is magnificent. Again, we are actually pending on this. So by the time you see this video, this could already be sold. Um, just waiting for the funds to come through. But uh, again, so with this one too, just like with Copala or with Kiviera, you get access to the resorts here as well. And um, very similar, very beautiful, a little bit more deserty vibe, a little more relaxed vibe. And um, actually the decor in this house, the way that they did it, the pictures actually don't even do the justice because it is just magnificent. I mean, if you look at here, you can really see, I mean, they turned this into a home, whereas a lot of these are just kind of like Airbnbs. This home was never airbnb It was only used for uh, for family and friends and things like this. This has a secondary guest house. Now look at this bathroom. They've got a, uh, a shower over here with like a waterfall. And then, I mean, you can chill in this bath and then look right over the uh, the golf course here. Absolutely amazing. Beautiful. And if, again, if you guys want to view any of these, you can message me, Brandon at CabalCribs.com or 
um, Instagram BK Cabo, YouTube BK Cabo, and I can uh, I can help you out. I can help you find any of these. All right, guys. If you guys need anything at all, go ahead, send me a message, and um, and yeah, I can I can help you out with all of your needs. Uh, like like always, doesn't matter what it is. I mean, in, in Cabo, if you guys want recommendations on the best restaurants, if you guys want recommendations on um, capital gains, if you want to know about uh, what else. A little tired today it's sunday if you want to know about <laughs> about dogs about the uh animal rescue if you want to get a cute little baby like this then you can we have um actually the owners of this house um they run a uh non organization and they help to uh, spade a lot of the street animals i mean they they do tons we're talking in the thousands um but they're always looking for people to adopt as well. They're always looking for people to foster. So anything like that, if you guys want to help out, um, yeah, send me a message and I can help you. All right, guys, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kill some flies here. <laughs> All right, have a wonderful day, guys, and I'll see you soon.